Jeff Slauson here from 19 News Now at the 19 News Digital Desk. Going to be showing you some video from a bus crash, an RTA bus crash in August of this year. This was on East 100th Street and Euclid Avenue. For those that are semi familiar with how the roads work there, it can be slightly confusing. There's a lot of the cases no left turns because the buses and their lane is technically on the opposite side of the road. That's exactly what happened here. And someone got very confused. You will see a sign that says no left hand turn. They decide to make one and come in contact with that bus. We got multiple angles on this from various different cameras that are available. Let's first show you. Let's see. Let's do this video first. Uh, this one has no sound to it, but you'll see on the right hand side of your screen that white car making the turn and then the bus coming into contact with them. I want to show it to you again here. Watch the right hand side of your screen there. Bus starts to go straight. Car turns. That's when they crash into each other. Here's an alternate angle of that from the street view. Again, this was Euclid and East 100th Street. You can see the bus starting to go there and that's when the contact is made. I know a little bit difficult from there, uh, but the angles there, not necessarily the greatest. Obviously, it's decent, but what we're going to see now is from inside of the bus itself. There is audio to this as well. So watch on the right hand side of the video. You're going to see a sign pop up in about two seconds. That sign right there. You can see it. No right hand turn. That's when this happens. All right, so let's show you this one one more time here. Again, watch the right hand side. That's where you're going to see the car coming over, and then you're also going to see the sign uh, in there uh, as well. The sign that very clearly says no left hand turn. That driver thought, you know what? That's not for me. That's for everybody else. So look, they make the left, make the left, and boom. Now, multiple people were sent to the hospital in this, but still a very scary scene. I want to show you now from inside of the bus. So this is the view from the driver's side of this. You'll see people are kind of just standing around. Take it from there. All right, so now I'm going to show you a second view here from inside of the bus. One more after this.
Now the last view that they give of this. Again, all coming from this here. Watch with the right hand side. That's just the sign. And that's you'll see the car making a turn. Multiple people taken to the hospital as a result of this. Everybody ended up being relatively okay, uh, but still a pretty scary scene. That driver was, uh, I believe, given a citation for the crash here. Um, officers ended up arriving. They were able to get the driver out of the car pretty safely, but still a scary situation for those people involved in it. Want to play it for you one more time, and then, of course, we'll let you go getting ready for 19 News starting over at 7. But again, watch the right-hand side of the screen. That's where you'll see the car t taking its time to get over. So much more information on this uh, tonight, of course, on 19 News. Six, 7 o'clock over on the CW. We're starting an hour there. We have our weather show, the latest on Hurricane Milton, all of that information available for you. Again, over on the CW. For now, I'm Jeff Slauson with 19 News. Have a great day, great night. Much more to come, both on air and online.